we are headed to the off-road wrecker games and so looking down here we're going to be driving for 20 minutes to head over here to Sand Hollow State Park. The drive to Sand Hollow has some gorgeous views, and when we arrived we initially tried to drive past it on the highway intending to come from the opposite direction. But the road the event is on isn't in great condition on the other side, so we retraced our steps. And we were awed by the crowd before us and the long line of vehicles going down the road to get into the event. We decided to just park at the large parking lot by the boat ramp, so we headed there. We've gotten to Sand Hollow and it is mass chaos. There's so many people here and the parking and the roads are all congested and there's just everyone's trying to get to the main event. So where we are right now is here on the map and the main event is happening right there. And we went over here to the boat ramp, they said it was full and they said to come over here to the water towers and there's like it's getting congested and people are coming down in here and there's supposed to be a shuttle service and we haven't seen any sign of an actual shuttle yet and it's it's only a mile so we're probably just going to actually stay parked here and we're just going to walk we are now walking over to the event the main event is right over that way and so we're just going to walk under the freeway first and then down the road we're so far hiking along it's doing pretty good we have a fence here in our way it's going to drop off over that way so we'll be fine Isaac joined us here. Hey, how's it going? Isaac, where are you from? Nashville, Tennessee. So Isaac flew out here all the way from Nashville, went to Nevada, you said Las Vegas airport? Mm -hmm. Yep. Got a rental car, and he's staying in an Airbnb here in St. George to come to this event. <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah. We just came from Salt Lake area, and that's only like a four hour drive. So that's the area that we're heading to right now, and uh, so far the walk is going pretty good. It is not very high right here, so we can easily step over it and get out onto the road. Here's the cars that are parked all along this road, and it goes on for quite a ways until you get to the actual event. Alaska, that is the farthest away license plate that I've seen. Here's a license plate from Virginia. Vehicles of all types were parked along the road wherever they could fit, in parallel, perpendicular, diagonal, or a mixture of the above in the case of these trucks and trailers. We found several locations we could have parked, but they had people at the entrance to the road not letting any more vehicles drive down the road when we had tried earlier. After only about a 20 minute walk, we arrived at the main event where they were already getting started. We've arrived at the main event finally. This is it right here. And who's this guy? For Matt Whitman Looks like they're starting. Yeah. I gotta find the rest of our spray paint. All of these Isuzus that, are, that you see staged right between the records here are going to get painted here and then also judged. We have perfect conditions for a quality paint job. We're in the sand, outside, slightly windy, could not be any better. You guys are going to see some prime work here today. All right, now we need the rest of the people to paint. So we need five people. Yeah, it's almost like blasphemy, isn't it? Hey, Robbie! Come on, Robbie. Got it? All right, all competitors, to speed up the process a little bit, let's start over at Fabrets. Fabrets, go pick the people that you want to pick for your paint job. Go ahead and pick some people from the crowd. Same with BSF. Whoever you have around you wants to help you paint the vehicle, pick some people from the crowd. Rory with Trailmater, I see you're down there already, so whoever is surrounding you, pick somebody that wants to help. Paint! Don't paint Lizzie's shoes. See Lizzie's shoes are changing color as we speak. Every um, time we go to school, me and my dad always watch on the road. Oh, yeah? Marvin, do you look over there? Lizzie's on the roof while everyone else doesn't care. It's like, what are they doing? <laughs> Seriously, the entire car has to be painted. So getting on the roof and getting painting from the top down is probably a pretty solid idea. I definitely agree with you. The strategy over at Moore right now is above everyone else. Who else can keep up? We're, we're, I see some racing stripes. Yeah, but okay. racing stripes with tape. Hey, was that okay? Was that allowed? Anybody know? Let's get this moving because who wants to see the real events going, especially over there? The crowd over oh, down by the oh, lake. Have a good buzz. Who wants to see the real events going? There we go. I see one hand up. I see more hands up. There we go. They are waiting on all of you. The faster you guys get this done, the more people get to enjoy the events because you know what? 
we all know the rollover is going to be the coolest. Or what, what do you think is going to be the coolest? Man, I'm really looking forward to the dino as well. Here's the record. Well, with the crowd, Here's the for me, it's that about what is your viewing painting. experience. If you love to be literally and sit down and watch, just like if you're watching some YouTube videos. The fabric, they have fabric finished painting their vehicles. And here's a quick little tour of all of the vehicles that just got painted. Take on the and the wreckers go with them. first competition of the day. Merlin is doing the flex off, which is right behind the welder. And then Eric is doing the rollover competition, and Rory will be the first on the dyno. You guys don't want to miss that one for sure. We're walking around. Yeah, we're walking there they go, heading out to begin the games. I'm excited. Let's go check it out. There's Trail Mater. So let's give it up for our military and all our vets. Let's give it up for all of you. Let's do it. Go! All right. We are in four wheel drive this time. Oh. And we're digging. It's digging hard. It's wow, digging and it's moving. He's got to struggle a lot more on this one. That's a lot of weight. Let's see if he can make his real steer work on this one. Get out of the grooves to not dig himself in too far. Did they forget the air compressor to put on the lockers? All four tires were spinning, so I think lockers are Everybody engaged. Wants hey, Judge, Judge, come here. Come here. What are your thoughts on this issue where he has to change up his game plan midway? I don't know. Maybe the original plan was a little uh, ambitious. I'm not sure, but, uh, you know, I was just sitting here thinking. Any money that I am robbed with... He is digging hard.
to a new event. This is flipping over a vehicle here on the beach. Alright, you ready? You can draw that one. And that one. 
carpet. They forfeit too wide. forfeit because their rig is too wide for that roller. Oh, Eric is out of What's he doing? Uh oh, and the banana's going somewhere. All I know is that gold dude. Yeah! Oh, the one and only genius. The one and only genius here. If you're going to do it, do it right the first time. If we remember from that, he goes, he pulls, like, oh, we need more rope, we need a bridle, oh, we need to go for two wheel drive before we just, oh, can we uh, get some assist? How much money did you get? I gotta know, I gotta know. Chris, well, I'm just saying, how cheating. much did he pay for this? Cheating. Oh, I see a knife coming out. Somebody pull the knife. I'm pulling out of one. I'm gonna have some fun tonight. I said I came to party. No, oh, he came to party, so if you want to party, hang out tonight and have a good time. Good evening. I wonder if they were looking for that air compressor that they had on the big record the other day. It you gotta is get true. some slack, get that static energy. Oh, 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 we broke something. They're not doing that. They're not happy. Oh, look at that underneath. Oh, my goodness, folks. We got our first massacre. Who shows that helping? And guess what? That gets to fix it. It just fell out of gear. They're not supposed to transfer it. Well, he's not busy working on the record or the Bobby. Oh, you hear that? It was like that beforehand. What do we have? What happened? No, nothing, nothing fell. It might have just popped out of gear. Okay. <laughs> well, what was that? What happened? Give us the breakdown of what you what you witnessed. Well, it went forward, and then it stopped going forward. <laughs> Interesting. So what can you do to make it go backwards? Yep, something went and boom. Yep. Uh, I mean, it goes backwards. Oh, just don't tell Matt. Royce. Good enough. Might be a sign of a broken transfer case or even transmission. No, no, no. Oh, no. Eric's like, what's going on, guys? Let's just do this event. I heard noise come out of the front end, actually. That, that would actually. Uh, you heard a crack. Because obviously, like, you guys know, I know mechanics. This is the transfer case. What does that mean for people that drive Honda Civics and Elon Musk cars? Basically the piece that connects the transmission to the front and the rear. So whatever distributes the power from the transmission onto the axle. Yep. <laughs> hey, can we get that sound one more time? That was cool. I like to hear broken stuff. Oh, here he comes. Let's see if we can hear it. Crack, 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 crack. Did you guys hear that? Thinking outside the box, breaking stuff, but thankfully it's not his stuff, so he doesn't care. And neither do you, right? Well, yes. yes. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Who wants the way at this event? They're building sandcastles and the drivers get extra points the more of these they're able to get to.
ça
spotlight right there on Blue Steel. Those usually do not break. Those are right. strong. Yeah, so that soft shackle in between the two Yankum ropes is what broke. And so it flew in both directions and it broke, it broke the headlight on uh, Blue Steel. Yeah, it broke the mirror. Yeah, yeah. That was a lot of energy. Uh, Yeah. Oh, in the mirror. Ben. Hey, how about smoothness? Very smooth. Oh yeah, that, that's a smooth. Shave them here close. Nice. <laughs> so I think we've done pretty good. That's the best mitigation. I think so. Thank you guys for all coming out. This is awesome. This sand is really soft, really whipped up. Here's the damage that occurred, broke the headlight right there, took off the side mirror. Started here and full throttled it there. Right. right. I thought they doubled it, and that's. I would have said something if I would have seen that. Yeah. I knew. I knew Paul was gonna go hammer down. He has <laughs> on everything. So Paul, that's that. Paul. Yeah. 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 No, that's a single shack single and, shackle. I, and I, I said that's the difference between Paul and Rory is Paul's a derby guy. He can take a hit. Rory doesn't Paul, derby right Paul's right? a derby guy for sure. Yeah. 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 So. Yeah, that's a. They, it was a single three-eight soft shackle with a nine-thousand-pound working load limit, and we hit it at like forty miles an hour. Yeah, you guys hit. It. Oh, he hit it harder than anybody okay. today. Oh, absolutely, by a very large margin. Oh, where's the bake off the show? Yeah, yeah. More. I did that. A little out. There it is. There there it is. Uh, All right, we better back up. <laughs> All right, hey, so Rudy. You just want to go for a ride in the truck, huh?
call? <laughs> I made it further than I thought it would. <laughs> We've had a fun-filled day and right now it's really just vendors uh, and you know people milling about food trucks things like that and we've had enough so we are headed back the as a shuttle the shuttle was too full as I'll show you that right now here's the line to get on the shuttle and it's pretty long so we're gonna go ahead and just walk again back to our car so due to the shuttle being that full I decided just to go ahead and just walk back to the car since it's only a mile and this road is super congested, so it's not like these people are going anywhere quickly anyway. That walk was definitely longer on the way out than on the way in this morning. We're finally getting back to the car. Right there. It's looking good and dusty. Almost looks like it's a different color. It's kind of a reddish sheen to it. We're gonna head back to the house now. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow for the second day of the Off-Road Wrecker Games.